Welcome back everyone. I'm meteorologist Jordan Frazier. Let's jump right into our jet stream, which is showing just all this hot and dry air staying right over top of us. But notice this as we head into the weekend, you're going to notice a slight change more so into Tuesday. You still got the main center of that hot air just sitting over the central and the Midwestern parts of the US Sunday. Here we go. It starts to kind of move a little bit closer toward the central areas. We're talking Kansas, Oklahoma, going into Colorado as well as New Mexico. Really not seeing a whole lot right over central Texas. That means we're actually going to see a slight and I mean very slight cooling in terms of temperatures. Today you kind of already noticed, well, we're not hitting the triple digits, at least across most of the region. Waco at 97, 98 in Austin, San Antonio being one of the warmer spots as well as San Angelo at 99 degrees. And well, this is because we had a little bit more cloud cover and a little bit more precipitation around the region, not widespread like we had a few days ago, but enough to noticeably bring the temperature down. Notice this as well. The winds are coming out from the northeast. That means we are still getting some pretty humid conditions. That's why the feels like temperatures are certainly up there. Let's check out that hour by hour radar. Any kind of showers, any kind of clouds you're seeing. Well, that's going to push out pretty early during those overnight hours. Starting off your tomorrow morning, well, pretty nice and clear. Couple of stray clouds, maybe a spotted shower, not big in terms of precipitation. Even Sunday, similar situation going into the morning, afternoon, a little bit more in terms of cloud cover, but really nothing big in terms of shower activity. Forecast lows for tonight. Well, you're going to be seeing a little bit more in terms of those mid to upper 70s, 76 Waco, 77 for College Station. Highs for tomorrow. Well, you're going to see those triple digits make a comeback 101 in Waco 100 in Temple and 101 in Cameron as well as Hearn. And even as we head into that extended forecast, you might see a little bit of relief going into Sunday and Monday. And I mean little as in like four degrees cooler looking at probably 100 tomorrow and then 96 Sunday lows might actually be a little bit lower, but that quickly returns in terms of heat back up on Tuesday might see the small chance for showers coming up Thursday, Friday, still far out, but you know what? We can only hope that we get some more rain, Chris. Yeah, Jordan, when it's 96 and that's 10 degrees below the 106 we were seeing a month ago, we'll take it, right? Exactly. All right, thank you, Jordan.